Hello and welcome. This is Prabhat and you are watching Peace News International, starting with the headlines. The Indian Cultural Festival was held at the famous Pobeda Palace in Moscow. A public event, Journey to Wellness, was organized at an Abhuti Retreat Center in Novato City, Western California. A public program, Evening in Tranquility, was held at the Brahmakumaris Meditation Center, San Francisco. Now the news in detail. The Indian Cultural Festival was held at the famous Pobeda Palace in Moscow, the capital of Russia, where the Indian Embassy, members of the Center of Spiritual Development Moscow, the Indian National Cultural Center, SITA, the Society of Russian Indian Friendship, DISHA, and Brahmakumaris Moscow were present. The creative team of Pobeda Palace gave a grand welcome to all the guests. This intense whole day program was designed so well that invitees could take advantage of Hat Yoga, Kathak Dance, Raj Yoga Meditation and many more events. On this occasion, Director of Brahma Kumari's Moscow, BK Sister Sudha, talked about the advantages of Raj Yoga Meditation and beautifully explained its method. Apart from this, Sister Sudha gave tips on how to live happily while conducting a speech about stress and depression. Also present in this program was senior brother of Brahma Kumari's Russia, BK Vijay. At the opening ceremony of the festival, the Director General of the Centre for Spiritual Development, Sudharani Gupta, the President of the Indian Business Alliance Association, Sami Kotwani, the President of the Indian National Cultural Centre, Dasha Kotwani, and many other renowned personalities were present. During this festival, the head of the literary and musical living room of the Palace of Culture, Kuznetsova Tatyana Vladimirovna, was awarded the highest award of the Center of Spiritual Development, the Diamond of Benevolence. The guests of the festival had the opportunity to not only participate in master classes in meditation, yoga and dancing, but also to taste dishes of the national cuisine of India and buy Indian products. A full-day public event on Journey to Wellness was organized at the Brahma Kumari Sanabhuti Retreat Center located in Novato City, Western California. The purpose of this event was to make people aware of holistic wellness so that they take benefit from it. It became a golden opportunity for all participants to gather important information from doctors, healers and spiritual counsellors about how to keep mind and body healthy. Apart from that, many other workshops were organized, which were addressed by keynote speaker and director of Peace Village, Texas, B.K. Hansa Ravel. She advised everyone to practice Raj Yoga meditation for mental empowerment. Non-violence, truthfulness, non-stealing, celibacy, and non-greed. So if we follow these five uh, elements, we can set a perfect relationship between society and myself. How we eat also is important. We don't eat when we watch TV, texting, uh, no reading newspaper or book when you are eating. You sit, you connect with the food. Digestion is a process which starts way ahead of time before we actually consume the food, right? So what we touch is our skin goes into the blood. Make sense? So all the herbs and spices we cut when we cook automatically has healing effect on our mind body. You can smell it 
So the body has that organic memory how to process it. So what I'm eating ahead of time, when I take time to think about it, I process it better, right? So the digestion improves just thinking about it. In that silence, you can have a far sight. So you can see beyond your past problems. You can see future, your bright future. You can see the, the real power within you. And so you can do one movement in your legs and it affects the body 10 times. Besides that, a public program, Evening in Tranquility, was organized by the Brahma Kumaris Meditation Center in San Francisco. Senior Raj Yoga teacher Brother Mark from Texas gave a talk on the importance of meditation in facing life's problems and provided recommendations on how to incorporate meditation into daily life. 5-10 minutes in the morning, 2-3 minutes during the day, and 5 minutes at night. If you practice this for one month, very sincerely, you'll see total transformation in yourself, guaranteed. He made everyone practice Raj Yoga meditation with guided commentary. Besides Brother Mark, a senior Raj Yoga teacher at the San Francisco Center, Sister Kyoko, played the angelic harp. Participants experienced deep peace and bliss during the meditation exercise and were inspired to learn Raj Yoga meditation in follow-up classes at the Brahma Kumari Center. That's all in Peace News International for now. See you in another bulletin. Thanks for watching.